in Blind Bob's book. Glad you liked it. It wasn't easy getting it. Without the journey, the reward is na half a sweet. That's, uh, what's her name, uh, old chestnut rune in these parts. Still as true as the sky is green. Green? Had an accident with a chroma charm when I was a wee lad. Every morning Blind Bob wakes up, the sky's a different colour. Today it's green. Hey. Ah, Rose Petal, we meet again. What can I help you with? Do you know where I can find Minstrum Magda? Oh, he knows her, Blind Bob does. He knows her well. Nice lady. Best sort not soup south of lame bastard hill. Do you know where she is today? Oh, she moves around, Magda does. Ain't seen her round here in a while. You might try asking someone other than Blind Bob. Like who? I don't know anyone in the city. Well, you might have more luck asking Crazy Clara. Lives up Crab Ben, Clara does, on Hangman Span, in view of Friar's Keep. Crazy as a turnip, Clara is. But she's also got a scout wing's eyes. She knows more than she lets on. Where can I find this crazy Clara again? You can usually find her on Hangman Span. That's up Crab Bend east of Southgate, towards Friar's Keep, the prison. Thank you, Mr. Bob. Oh, just call me theoretically. We're friends now, ye and I. Even here, on this deserted street, they're really serious about this industrial revolution of theirs. These doors and windows are all locked or boarded up. Does anyone even live here anymore? Hi there. Are you crazy... Um, are you Clara by any chance? You've been a bad girl, Clara. You'll have to be punished. My baby, my baby. Gone, gone, gone. What happened to your baby? Are you a spook? Do you dangle? Never fraternize with spooks, Clara. They can eat your soul. I'm... I'm pretty sure I'm not a spook. But you do dangle. I do? I honestly don't know. Dangle from their necks, the murderers do. Mind you stay good, Clara, or you dangle too. And then you turn into a spook. Oh, no, I don't dangle. I'm alive, see? Ah, uh, no! Clara has been bad. She must be punished. No, please, no, it burns. Pretty thing, pretty thing. No more, please, no more. God, I'm... I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to... Are you okay? 
My baby, my beautiful baby. All gone, all gone. Sleep now, beautiful. Everything will be better in the morning. I'm sorry, Flower, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you, Clara. So you lost something? Or someone? My baby. Yes, that part I got. Your baby. Is it a child? A pet? Westerlings caught him in a net. Just like a butterfly. That's illegal, that is. Can't have that now, can we? Boxed him right up. We'll take care of him, put him to sleep for you. Pretty thing. Poor thing. My baby. So it is your pet. A dog? Cat? I'm guessing there are stranger pets in this world. No stranger. Best friend. You'll never have friends. You've been bad. No, please no. My friend. You said the Westerlings took him. Who are the Westerlings? The ghetto's close. Stand back. What's that you've got there, eh? Give us that thing right now. The soldiers took him. What did they do with him? We'll take care of him, we will. Gone. But close. So close. I still hear him, my baby. I still hear him crying. Do you want me to help you find your baby? Find baby? Yes, if I can. I'll try. Do you know where he is? Caged up like the twinkles in a diamond. He was coming home to Mammy. Home. Never again. Never. Never. Don't say that. We'll find him, okay? Hello again, Clara. My baby? Not yet. But I'll try my best, okay? I don't want you to try your best, Clara. I want you to do your best. Gone. 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 Hey, you can't go in there. That must be Crazy Clara's pet. It's really cute. I see you got your baby back. Safe now. We are happy. So, so happy. I'm glad. Look, I'm trying to find Minstrel Magda. Do you know where she is? Magda? Where is Magda? That's what I need to know. Please, could you try and focus for a second? I really need to find Minstrel Magda. Cup of soup, Clara? Says the soup lady. Oh, yes, please. Right you are, then. 
Mmm, salt nut soup, our favourite. What do you mean? Oh, soup lady, as in soup kitchen. She runs a soup kitchen. Soup. Soup for the poor and homeless. Warm and thick with peas and carrots in it. And not only peas and carrots, but dubious lumps too. Where is Magda's soup kitchen? I go down there every morning to have my soup. I do. She's nice, she is. The soup lady. You ask her nicely, I'm sure she'll give you a cup too. Down where? The market? We're just down the street, Clara, at the Southgate Market from sunrise till midday every day. You come by any time, you hear? That's right. The soup kitchen. I pass right by it. Thanks, Clara. Take good care of your baby, okay? He's a beautiful pet. Wave goodbye now. Wave goodbye, little one. Good morning, dear. You look hungry. Do you want some soup? All profits go to the refuge. We shelter and feed the homeless and the penniless. No, thank you. Are you Minstrom Magda? Shh, not so loud. There are ears everywhere. Who are you? What do you want? I'm just looking for Minstrom Magda. I don't know any Minstrom Magda. There are no Minstrom in this city. Not anymore. But I was told that you... that Minstrom... Like I said, there are none left. I didn't know that. I don't know anything. I was just told that... that Magda could help me. And who, pray tell, told you that? The innkeeper at the Journeyman. Oh? And who would that be? Her name is Ben Rime Salmon. I see. So Ben Rime sent you to find Magda. Now why would she do a thing like that? Because I'm... I'm, um, not from around here. That much is quite obvious. Very well, dear. I do believe that you're as lost as you seem to be. I'm Magda. Just Magda, mind, and you would do well to address me as such. Either that or ma'am. No titles, no honorifics. Ben Rime ought to have made that clear to you. I will try and assist you with any questions that you may have, and maybe even point you in the right direction. But be discreet. Like I said, there are ears everywhere. Why did the innkeeper tell me to see you? Most likely because I have assisted travelers like you before. But the times have changed. Mercuria has become a very dangerous place for people like yourself. For me too, but I belong here. You do not. You think? I just want to go home. And so you should, with haste. There's no adventure to be had here. Not anymore. So there's nothing you can do for me? Like I said, I will assist you with any questions you may have, and I will point you in the right direction. But that is all I can do. Do you know anyone by the name of April Ryan? April? I may have heard that name before. What would you with her? Uh, I don't know. I need to find her. We have something in common and I think... I think she's in trouble. And you intend to save her? How do you propose to do that? I don't know that either. I just need to find her. Hmm... Well, I apologize, but I cannot help you there. Can you help me get back to my world? No, I cannot. It's too dangerous. But I can point you in the direction of someone who might be able to help you. You will need to enter Old Town. 
They call it the magic ghetto these days, after our protectors rebuilt the wall. The entrance to the ghetto is across the square. The gate is usually open, but right now the soldiers are conducting a raid. You will have to wait until they open the gates again. Where do I go once I'm on the inside? Seek out an artisan of the magic craft. Their skills have been mostly outlawed by the Azadi, except inside the ghetto. <laughs>